What is going on guys? Grave here. Yesterday we got some more disappointing news about Battlefield 2042 just to kind of add to the disappointing news of, of the game just kind of in general we've had over the last several months. And that is the first season, season one, has now been delayed again until summer. And this is probably, I would say at the earliest, would probably see it come out would probably be June. Uh, and of course it was already delayed once, you know, it was already delayed to spring. That was kind of what they talked about to begin with. And now that this is delayed till June, it wouldn't matter to me if the game was really good. There's just not enough weapons, not enough maps. If the game was really enjoyable, seven, eight, nine months for players to wait for new content is too long, even in a really good game, when you don't have that much content to begin with. And that's not including all the other issues the game has as well. And it's very disappointing, I think, to a lot of people in the community because they wanted the game to be good. They want to enjoy the game. And of course, DICE and EA kind of came out with their blanket statement again yesterday saying, they want the community to tell them, you know, kind of what they want with the game. They want to hear your feedback. They've been saying that for several months now, and it really does not seem to change anything because the majority of the community doesn't like specialists. And if you do like them or you don't, I mean, I really, you know, I, I don't care either way. Uh, people have their own opinion. That's perfectly fine. I'm not a fan of specialists. They added it in the game. kind of is what it is. But if EA and DICE really want to do what the community wants with this game, they should listen and say, Come out with a statement and say, we hear your feedback about specialists. We're going to remove them or we're thinking about removing them or we're going to test a new game mode without specialists, you know, having, you know, their abilities and things being in there. I kind of hate they have these blanket statements about how they want to, you know, talk to the community to improve the game, but we never really hear anything after that. Dice LA is kind of taken over and I really do think they could do a good job with improving the game. Now, will it make it the best Battlefield game ever? I don't know. Will it be like Battlefield 4 and actually be improved enough to where years down the road is more enjoyable than it was to begin with? I could say the same thing about Battlefield 5. Personally, for me, Battlefield 5 played better at the end than it did at the start. I'm not sure exactly what will happen, but I just kind of hate in general for gaming fans out there that this delayed or canceled a lot of other games that EA was working on. Uh, one of the biggest ones I can think of is Battlefield 3 because, uh, excuse me, Battlefront 3, because I thought Battlefront 2. Uh, as the game's life cycle went on, got to be a better game over time. And actually, Battlefield or Battlefront 2 was put on the back burner, kind of canceled because of Battlefield 2042. And it seems like this was a game that was, I don't, I'm not sure if it was rushed at the end, if they had a totally different plan and they scrapped it. it some people think that it was going to be a Battle Royale style game and they scrapped that and just went back to multiplayer. I'm not sure what went on, but it feels like that it was just completely scrapped uh, almost within like a year uh, of it coming out, you know, a year of the release, within a year of the release. And they kind of just kind of had to throw things together. It does not feel like it was a game that was developed, you know, for all these extra years they were talking about. It does not feel like a game that was developed because they canceled other things and they focused all their work on this individual game. If that was the case, it would have played a lot better when it was released. Overall, People, in my opinion, have not been happy with Battlefield in a really long time. Personally, for me, I've not been happy with Battlefield since Battlefield 3. Uh, Y'all have heard me say it a million times here on the channel. I've played them all. And, and all the games from the original Battlefield games up until Battlefield 3, I really enjoyed. Since then, I've not been a huge fan. And I think over the last several years, since about Hardline, a lot of the community in general has stopped really enjoying Battlefield as much as they used to. So I'm not sure exactly what EA and DICE are going to do here. They won't release sales numbers because they say they're lower than they anticipated, but they still say people are enjoying the game, which I guess some of us can agree or disagree. There's still a good bit of people playing on console. I know the PC side's lost a lot of the player base. But overall, I think there could be some improvements. Uh, could they improve the game and make it free to play? Would that be good? I think so. I think it could have its problems as well, but I still think it could be a positive. Could they improve the game and can kind of continue with what their plans were to begin with? Yes. Will it ever happen? I'm not sure. I'm kind of curious what you guys think. Are you disappointed to hear about that season being delayed again? I mean, it's probably a good thing overall, but at the same time, I think more and more players are going to be gone by that point that may never ever experience any of these seasons anyway. So leave me a comment with your thoughts. And of course, if you'd like to hit the like, if you hadn't subscribed yet, please do so. And I'll catch you next time. Peace.